Welcome to English Treasure. Today's topic is the Statue of Liberty. First, we will learn to pronounce some new words. Statue. Liberty. Harbor. Design. Sculptor. Cloaked. Roman. Goddess. Symbolizing. Freedom. Continents. Gold plated. Engraved. Declaration. Overthrow. Oppression. Slavery. Unveiled. Bronze. Oxidation. We'll start by speaking slowly. The Statue of Liberty stands on Liberty Island in New York Harbor. It was a gift from the French people to America and took 21 years to design and build. The statue weighs 225 tons and is as tall as a 22-story building. The sculptor Frederic Auguste Bartholdi designed it in the shape of a cloaked woman representing the Roman goddess Libertas. On her head is a crown with seven rays of light around it, symbolizing the light of freedom for the seven continents of Earth. The right hand holds a gold plated torch, and in the other hand is a stone plate engraved with the date of the Declaration of Independence. The statue's foot stands on a broken chain representing the overthrow of oppression and slavery and faces to the southeast where ships enter the port so those arriving can see its face. The statue was unveiled on October 28, 1886. It is made of bronze, but has since turned green because of oxidation. Now we will pronounce the words again, this time faster. Statue Liberty Harbor Design Sculptor Cloaked. Roman. Goddess. Symbolizing. Freedom. Continents. Gold plated. Engraved. Declaration Overthrow Oppression Slavery Unveiled Bronze Oxidation Now we will say the words again. 
this time at a medium speed. The Statue of Liberty stands on Liberty Island in New York Harbor. It was a gift from the French people to America and took 21 years to design and build. The statue weighs 225 tons and is as tall as a 22-story building. The sculptor, Frédéric Auguste Bartholdi, designed it in the shape of a cloaked woman, representing the Roman goddess Libertas. On her head is a crown with seven rays of light around it, symbolizing the light of freedom for the seven continents of Earth. The right hand holds a gold-plated torch, and in the other hand is a stone plate engraved with the date of the Declaration of Independence. The statue's foot stands on a broken chain, representing the overthrow of oppression and slavery, and faces to the southeast, where ships enter the port so those arriving can see its face. The statue was unveiled on October 28, 1886. It is made of bronze, but has since turned green because of oxidation. Now we will say the words again, this time at a natural speed. Statue. Liberty. Harbor. Design. Sculptor. Cloaked. Roman. Goddess. Symbolizing. Freedom. Continents. Gold-plated. Engraved. Declaration. Overthrow. Oppression. Slavery. Unveiled. Bronze. Oxidation. We will now say the words again this time at a native speaker's speed. The Statue of Liberty stands on Liberty Island in New York Harbor. It was a gift from the French people to America and took 21 years to design and build. The statue weighs 225 tons and is as tall as a 22-story building. The sculptor, Frédéric Auguste Bartholdi, designed it in the shape of a cloaked woman, representing the Roman goddess Libertas. On her head is a crown with seven rays of light around it, symbolizing the light of freedom for the seven continents of Earth. The right hand holds a gold-plated torch, and in the other hand is a stone plate engraved with the date of the Declaration of Independence. The statue's foot stands on a broken chain, representing the overthrow of oppression and slavery, and faces to the southeast, where ships enter the port, so those arriving can see its face. The statue was unveiled on October 28, 1886, it is made of bronze, but has since turned green because of oxidation. Now listen to these questions. What color was the statue when it was first built? Which hand of the Statue of Liberty holds a stone plate? There is only one word on the stone plate. What is it? If you know the answers, tell us in the comments. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, like it. If you learned from it, share it with your friends. And if you loved it, subscribe to the channel.